Hello and welcome students. A big welcome to my channel of Kinematics and Theory of Machine. So over here in the first module, today we are going to discuss about the fourth part. Here, in version of a single slider crank chain, we are going to discuss elaborately. There are pendulum pump, oscillating cylinder engine, rotary engine or gnome engine and quick return motion mechanism and finally the toggle mecha mechanism that one, one by one we are going to observe. So first comes the pendulum pump. In pendulum pump you can see in the given figure that just like the pendulum one segment of this particular link that is AB it actually periodically oscillates and similarly the connected another link that is BC that also moves and acts like a pendulum. The link 4 or the sliding pair is fixed. When link 2 or crank rotates, then the link 3 or the connecting rod oscillates about the pin, which is pivoted to link 4 at point C and piston attached to the piston rod or link 1 reciprocates in the cylinder. So this is why it is called as pendulum pump. Next come oscillating cylinder engine. In oscillating cylinder engine, it is very common that the piston oscillates within the cylinder but in this oscillating cylinder engine the cylinder itself oscillates outside the piston. The link 3 over here have a look that is the connecting rod which is fixed when crank that is link 2 or BD rotates the piston attached to the piston rod which is link 1 considered as the link 1 or AB it reciprocates and the cylinder which is link 4 mind it link 4 it oscillates about a pin at point A which is pivoted okay so this is called the oscillating cylinder engine next come rotary IC engine or gnome engine over here you can see that there are number of piston cylinder arrangement in this particular figure there are six it may be more than that also piston cylinder arrangement they are arrange in such a way that when there is a expansion of one particular set of piston cylinder then there will be compression for the other there, then there will be intake for the other and exhaust for the other now consisting several cylinder in one plane and all removal revolve about a fixed center O the crank is fixed over here crank means you can see fixed crank when the connecting rod rotates, the piston reciprocates inside the cylinder forming a rotary motion in link 1. Now finally, we are going to see the toggle mechanism or stone crusher. In stone crusher or toggle mechanism, when it is necessary to overcome a large resistance with a small driving force, this mechanism is much applicable. Link 4 and 5 are of equal length as the angle alpha it's a very small angle that you can see uh, on the left hand side the figure given the angle alpha decreases and link 4 and 5 approach being collinear the force required to overcome a given resistance decreases as f equal to 2p tan alpha if alpha tends to 0 then p tends to infinity also used in toggle clamping devices to hold the workpiece in this manner. So that's all for today's session. Hope you find it uh, useful and we'll meet soon with another video. Thank you very much.